great. So he's a little stiff, but he works. Oh, okay. We're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna let him see if he stretches out of it. We're warming him up to see if he. Poof. A trailer comes by and makes a lot of noise and Gabby's on the ground. Don't text and drive. He's such a pretty horse. Alright. Take everything from my pockets. This is all her. Are you gonna be able to close your eyes? Oh my gosh. She has candy in her pocket. Alright, so now we have Gabby up here. Because her horse is we're gonna do something different with him. There, look at that. That was a good one. That was a really good I'm one. Do that again. I thought I was going to walk. That was excellent. Do it again. Yeah, that was so good. It's okay if you change your riding each time. That's fine. So, basically, I mean, if Gabby helped with things on Finn that Sophie struggled with, it would be yeah. so much more beneficial for him. Because look at how Sophie just goes and goes and goes on him. And Gabby just rides him quiet. Look at that gorgeous head though. Like, isn't it, doesn't he have a nice head? Oh, I think he looks beautiful without all that head shaking. Like, I love seeing his head. He's like a real horse now, like Pin Pinocchio. He's like, look at me go, I'm a real boy now. too much work so that's probably why Sophie doesn't do it too because it's hard to hold herself up there for a long time that's probably why you struggle with it so so we're gonna do some exercises struggles with it because she's not good at it she says yeah nobody's good at it till you practice you think Gabby said it was hard I'm dying to ride my horse now And so should I use some kind of support boots or should I use uh, polos? Um, polos can be a struggle to wrap sometimes and if wrapped incorrectly it can cause more damage. Yeah. So you're better off with a support boot. What kind? Uh, like the blue ones that your daughter has. Okay. Those are cobs so I have to get new ones. Those are cobs so I have to get new ones. So they support the ligament? They'll support the whole thing. Okay. They cup underneath the fat lock to support underneath. Oh, okay. Are they all soft or can you get harder ones? They're all soft. Okay. Because they have to wrap properly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Like, you're doing this wrong, you're holding him, you're pulling on his face. You're holding him, you're what? Like, all the people who had all opinions about how we were doing it wrong and making him toss his head is like so crazy to think how, like, every single person has a different opinion and sees a different thing, and it turned out being the nose band. Yeah. Like, that just goes to show you that you can never know for sure. Yeah, even if you're with the horse, like even if you're sitting there like us, like we didn't know either. We threw at so many different things.
You keep going right to them. Don't go to the reins. Brandon, shorten those reins, Fiona. Don't shorten those reins. There's a place and a time for both. There is a place and a time for both. I totally agree. Sophie, Gabby, do you want me to sign us up and we'll come back to go for a trail? Yeah. He has been walking today. Yeah. So that's good. Yeah. That's our second biggest issue, I think, with him, is holding him back. I think that's been the biggest issue that just stemmed everything else. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. The biggest issue is, but yeah, I agree. Because holding him back puts the pressure on the nose band. And the biggest thing, too, is... But you know what, though? The he can learn how to ride that big trot, and he needs to go be able to go faster before he can go slower, I think. You need. I think he's got to be able to learn that he can stretch. Yeah. And then that he can stretch and slow down. Yeah. And I think Sophie's ready. I think so. I, I think Sophie's ready to let him go. We just have to uh, work on our core and our thigh muscles so we can stay steady. Yeah. That's all. You'd think that you would learn to stay steady just by doing it this much. Easier said than done. Yeah. And it depends if you're actually using the muscles. A horse like Sparky, you don't have to use those muscles. No. No, well the horse she's riding now, she has to use the sit up Hold muscles. Down that rain. You're pulling his nose to the outside a little bit. There you go. Good. Slow your rise again. I'm just happy that we we got one thing fixed. I mean people thought he had nerve damage. Change direction across the diagonal on a loose rein. Finn is definitely a horse that would benefit oh, from lunging, like all of you have said. All of you he have said. He wants to trust, but he's worried. You see the look uh, in his face. Yeah. So that's been the biggest thing. But the reason that they hold him back is because he's so fast. Just ride that big trot. Let him have that rein. Good. Love it. Body. Love so look it. over your shoulder where you want to go. Turn your whole body where you want to go. I can do that with my penny. That's what I'm she does. Planning. And now breathe. Look away from Chino. Good. The battery's about Let to die. Let him figure out that you're not going to grab him. Trusting, and you've got really good balance. You can ride that big old trot. Good boy. 
Gabby says that her horse gets upset and starts performing badly if she doesn't say good boy. None of my girls are good at sit trotting. And breathe like you want them to jog. Western jog. See if you can bring them back to you with your body. Challenge. I'm learning. I'm yeah. learning. Wow. Breathe again. Tighten your thighs. Hey, good boy. Try again for a couple steps. Imagine you're going to walk. Good job. Right down like he's gonna walk. Good boy. Your what is dad? My dad, my side is it's killing me. Take a walk. Gabby's dead. Just like a chino. Just like a chino. So Finn is finally dropping his head. How quiet can you go into that drop? Yeah? So at the walk he feels comfortable, but Fiona's saying that he doesn't feel safe because we've always pulled him back. He thinks he's doing barrels. And then go to the right of that one. Good. And sit around the barrel. Breathe. Hands forward. Don't make it too tight of a turn. It's a big turn. You don't want him tight to the barrel. Sit through the turn so he can lift his shoulder up. Big turn. Sit. Yeah. So much better. He's so wide on this side wow. and then tighter on the other side. Barrel. Look at that head. You see how you're going tight to the barrel and then really wide? Go really wide and then tight. So he's like, this is my lesson. Much better. Really wide here. Go really far away. And then think about getting closer. Out some legs. Pushing him in. Breathe. Go really wide. Sit. Inside and outside leg. Pushing him in. Good. Leaving his alone through the turn. Good. Go back to a big circle on the rail. Okay, so she's gonna and walk. trot 12 steps. Breathe out. Good. 
You ask him for the trot instead of actually squeezing and sending him. Just think about going a little faster at the walk. And okay, she's the she's gonna walk and twelve. Walk. Trot and halt. Five, four, two, one. Benny needs lots of transitions. Don't you know that you're beautiful?